Hello and welcome to EQ Magazine, India's oldest and largest solar media. Today joining us with us is Mr. Prashant Mathur, he is CEO of Satvik. Welcome sir. Thank you very much. Sir, first of all I would like to briefly know about Satvik. Uh, Satvik uh, is a 1 gigawatt uh, module manufacturer. We are based in uh, North India. Um, currently our product portfolio is um, primarily monopark uh, half cut, uh, 545, 45 and uh, also we are certified up to 595 watt panels and we have been uh, manufacturing solar panels for almost seven years now and um, as per as per market ranking we are amongst the top five uh, manufacturers in India. Uh, sir my next question is I would like to know about the product showcasing this year. So this year our product uh, showcasing is uh, we are our commercially available product right now is the 595 95 watt panels so that we are displaying here. We are also, um, you know, future we are getting into top corn products. So that also is, uh, you know, we are going to display here. And um, our technology roadmap is also in to giving uh, half half cut modules and high efficiency panels uh, for the market. In terms of our expansion, uh, we are adding another gigawatt, one gigawatt in our Ambala plant. So we will be a two gigawatt uh, manufacturer. Um, by the end of this year and we are for future also we are adding our um, 2 plus 2 gigawatt capacity in Gujarat uh, so we will end up with 2, two gigawatt of cell and 4 gigawatt of module. Uh, sir uh, your uh, few models uh, your models are LM approved right now so how do you see the growth? Yeah so um, ALMM our modules are approved up to 595 watt and um, this gives us an opportunity to bid for high quality, high efficiency product for uh, for you know small, large, and medium uh, projects. We have one of the very few people who have also bifacial product, which is an ALMM. So yeah, so ALMM has uh, helped us immensely, and uh, I think it's a it's a very good way of um, auditing manufacturers and um, you know approving and seeing what the technology and what the product is so it it gives a um, lot of um, what do you call it uh, the, the industry um, gets a lot of authenticity and it is a good way of um, um, not bringing any low quality product in the market uh, sir how do you see the bcd implementation on the market uh, bcd implementation um, is a good tool um, and uh, we have seen that a lot of imports happened before BCD. So the prices have not stabilized in the market yet. And you see a long range of prices which are available in the market. And uh, so which has led to a um, little slowdown uh, for the short term. And also some of the projects which are bid at very uh, old prices, um, which are not sustainable. So that is also leading to slowdown in the large developers area, and uh, yeah, so BCD is 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 going to help, but I think uh, more than BCD, I think ALMM is also something which which should be implemented, should keep, it should be there, and um, be, uh, currently I would say you know because of BCD, which the prices have gone up, and. Um, the gap between uh, grid connected and renewable uh, sources that has um, you know that has narrowed down so there is a temporary slowdown because of that but i think should be uh, it should improve uh, in the next quarter onwards okay sir how do you see the market opportunities and challenges so uh, market has got immense opportunities there is no doubt about it uh, india um, you know from 12 10 12 gigawatt we, we feel that this year India should be close to 20 gigawatt or could be more also. But uh, if India has to do 300 gigawatt of solar and 500 gigawatt of renewable energy by 2030, effectively it means about 30 gigawatt a uh, year will be the roadmap. Um, so India is already gearing up, all manufacturers are expanding. Uh, considering that India market will give them a base load. Apart from that, um, India is also becoming a global hub for manufacturing and a very potential alternative to China 
for all global markets, be it into Europe or in US. And uh, we are riding on that. So uh, we feel that India will be a significant uh, exporter of uh, solar uh, equipments into into all global markets. Okay. Sir, if you talk about Satvik, so I would like to ask you how Satvik is prepared for B2C market, especially for rooftop market. I would like to know about it. Yes, so one is uh, uh, we also have our EPC. So we not only sell and manufacture module, but we also uh, implement them in the market. So we, we do installations at our customers. So that is also a means of going directly to the end customer. Uh, normally, these are C and I and uh, utility customers. Um, from a B2C, we have a, a very uh, strong distribution network and our motto is to be uh, available at the last mile uh, wherein the customer can go and buy it from um, a dealer or a retailer. Um, those panels will be available uh, to, to them. So we are, we are even ramping up our distribution market and we will be available all over India and even internationally we are, we are creating distribution network. Okay. So sir, at last I would like to know about on what technology you are working on it presently and what you are going to upgrading in the future. Currently we are working on Monopark uh, half cut technology. Uh, that is the, uh, commercially it is available, it is the best technology which is available currently. But uh, as I said, uh, we are moving towards uh, Topcon and we are seeing SJT as well. Um, and we will, we are committed to bring the best quality and highest efficient module um, in the market. Okay. So I wish you all the best for your future endeavor, sir, as well as for Satvik. And thank you for joining us and thanks for sharing your time. Thank you. Thank you.